Dante's Boxing Nation, what's going on guys? So after Devin Haney stops Zara Abdullayev, he becomes a WBC mandatory for Lomachenko's belt. And right after the fight, he wasted no time to call out Lomachenko. He said his name is not Lomachenko, it's Nomachenko because he doesn't want to fight me. This is what Devin Haney said. So Devin Haney is putting pressure on Vasil Lomachenko to take the fight. And despite Lomachenko calling out Javante Tank Davis for years, he still has not responded to Devin Haney. Now Lomachenko is planning on coming back and fighting the winner of Richard Comey versus uh, Teofimo Lopez, but that's gonna take a long time. Which is why now Lomachenko is thinking about taking another fight before the year ends, but not against Devin Haney. This is really interesting because Lomachenko, he missed out on the Mikey Garcia fight. Uh, Mikey Garcia and his people, they claim that Lomachenko did not want to fight him. Now you have Devin Haney, who's at lightweight. So now this is another opportunity for Devin Haney to fight someone who's calling him out that's very dangerous. Devin Haney, he just recently said that he believes Lomachenko's style is tailor-made for him. We know that Lomachenko, he had problems. He struggled against Luke Campbell. By his own admission, he struggled. He said that that was his toughest fight, which is why I don't understand why some of these fans, they go out of their way to try to defend Lomachenko when Loma himself is even saying these things. So it's almost like Lomachenko's fans are arguing with Lomachenko just to defend him. They're like, shut up, Lomachenko. Stop lying. That wasn't your most difficult fight. I'm over here trying to defend you and you're making it hard for me to do it by telling the damn truth. So stop telling the truth, Loma. This is exactly how they sound. They're in my comment section saying, that's BS. How could that be a difficult fight for Loma when he won almost every round? That's what Loma said. That's what Loma said, okay? But with that being said, uh, the fact that Loma did say that Luke Campbell was his most difficult fight, and he attributes that to Luke Campbell's reach and his height and his boxing ability. The fact that Devin Haney is a better boxer than Luke Campbell, he's quicker than Luke Campbell, and he has the same type of reach that a Luke Campbell has, at least similar. He's taller than Lomachenko as well. He's not as tall as Luke, but he's taller than Lomachenko. That tells us at the least Devin Haney would do better against Loma than Luke Campbell did, which is not good news for Lomachenko. We'll see what happens. We'll see what uh, Loma decides to do. We'll see what happens in that uh, Comey versus Lopez fight. That should be an excellent fight as well. But anyway, I'm going to wrap this video up. That's all I got for now, guys. I'm on to the next one. Rotation of the shoulder, then back in.